welcome welcome to my channel today i'm going to cook ugali and uh, sukuma wiki we call it sukuma wiki sukuma wiki is this kale mixed with mixed with spinach so today this is what i'm cooking ugali is wheat uh not wheat um it's a cornmeal ugali is a cornmeal so I will be cooking that today and I am welcoming you. I think I'm going to do this video in uh, two videos because I have to cut this and then I also want to show you how to cook the ugali. So maybe this a separate video and then the ugali a separate video. So uh, most people here in the U.S., they they eat this kale as they don't eat it the way we eat it for us we cook we cook and eat it with a, a, like a meal you know but here they do it different it's like um they do it so different but i wanna share with you uh, different cultures this is our culture how we cook our food so when I go to buy this in the stores, I normally finish all of them because look at all this. Look at all this. All this. Yeah. All of this. And there's more here. All this is what I'll cook. But it's not a lot. It looks like it's a lot, but it's not a lot because it's going to condense and you know because as i cook because how i'll cook i'll cook with onion put onion and uh, when i put onion it will brown and then i put this so and there's more here so you can imagine I'm doing it raw so that you see everything, what we do. It's good to share what people do because so many people have shared with me what they they eat. And also, it's, it's different from what we eat. So I also thought, why don't I also share what we eat, you know? It's... So this... This is what I'll cook all this is what i'll cook so how many are there let's count together so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen so i'll wash them and then i'm going to cut them Normally in our culture, what we do when we are cutting, we sit down. So I brought a chair here and a table. We normally cut and you have to bend like this. But for me now, so that you're able to see the position, I've placed this video so that you're able to see. I'm going to use this table. And then I'm going to use this chair. This chair. This one. So I'm going to sit here. These are not chairs that we use in the kitchen, but I brought it so that you actually see culture-wise what culture means. Culture is very enjoyable. It's good to learn different methods, see different methods, and you could try it. Because when people come, when people come to our country, they love our food. They tell me, Hannah, what I loved is the food the food the food is very african food is uh cooked in different ways different cultures cook different way but the all the taste is similar you know the whole or the, the the all of them are similar you'll get nigerians you'll get Ghanaians, you'll get ethiopians you'll get you know all those they cook and when they cook it's like a similar taste. We have we have the same, you know, uh, we're using the same like knowledge, but dif cooking differently. But here I found it's 
totally different because somebody will just go and buy just this leaf and then this maybe they'll use it as a smoothie you know as uh what do you call it they cut them raw and they eat well you know very little you know very but us we eat all these as a, this is a real meal in an african country this is a real meal so i'm going to show you how we do it so ugali uh, i will take you through what is ugali and how what is this food that we are eating with and then i'm gonna cook the meat meat everybody knows how to cook so meat is meat meat are cook different uh separate and then we're gonna eat now the meat separate i mean the meat we serve separate and this we serve separate when it's cooked and then the ugali that food is out of this world so i'm going to share with you uh, i'll do these videos probably separately because by the time i cut this i want you to uh, get through get the feeling and feel and when people when we're doing that uh you're not doing it alone you're doing it with your family if you have uh kids you're doing it with your kids you're doing it with whoever is in the house or even yourself and you are enjoying as you cut that's how we bond we bond by uh doing this kind of work and this kind of work is involving because every day you can imagine like now i'm from work it's very very involving sometimes uh probably you've done a double or you've done an overtime or you've even done eight hours like where i work the eight hours you do is enough to be called a double so when you come home you are so tired so you i always want to eat fresh because i have used so much energy thinking you know in the computer thinking and thinking and thinking so you need good food you need to take care of yourself you need to take care of your body you always need to be fresh to go to work when you're fresh and so that you give you be productive and you give good results and also your body you are taking care of your body this is this is your master this is you are your master this is your master the body is your master so you have to feed your body so without further ado I want to wash this and we're going to wash together and uh, you know so I have to take out this this is what it says actually it's organic see in <laughs> here what we do we buy things that are organic because that's what we know we're used to organic you know organic food and that's what <laughs> we're looking for so uh, this is that so yeah so i bought them in safeway very when i cook it's mm, the taste is mm, out of this world but before i do anything i am so hungry i need the energy so i had eaten this half then um i started doing things and then uh, you know so this is from india this one i bought so i like i like this cake because it's the cake like it's cooked like where i come from you know when i buy other cakes i feel they are soggy and i'm not getting the feel i'm not getting the the real taste that i know but this one i'm getting the taste that i know mm. we need energy to do all this work you need a lot of energy because the ugali you're gonna mix so you're also using energy and remember you're from work you also did a lot of work all your energy was there and now you also energy here so this is what i this i buy from an Indian store because I feel like they they are nearer to what we want to taste see they cook roti we cook chapati similar and it's done
so now that i have the energy it's a lot of work let's go through what i do and what is done what's required it's a lot of things it's a lot now what i'm doing i need this paper because this is where i put the sticks you know i don't cook the sticks so i will i'll be taking out the sticks and these are the papers that came out and then i'll be i'll be cutting them in here this is where i put them and then we'll cook them right after that we'll cook the ugali i'll take you through the ugali process this is normally a process that is long cooking this it's a very long process so you can imagine cooking all this i'm wondering oh my goodness it's a lot it's a lot it's a lot cooking all this is a lot of work so unfortunately i haven't uh it's just washing, not a big deal washing. And then maybe I'll put them here so that everybody can see what I'm doing. I can place them here. I don't have a big tray. Normally we put in very big trays, but it looks like I don't have a very big tray. So I'll put them, I'll put in these trays. This one became disfigured. So we, we use what we have. So I'm going to get my knife, good knife. I'll get my knife, good knife. And then you have to have a sharp knife because these things are, oops. I think I'm going to cut with scissors. So what I'm doing, I'm cutting the this thing. And they are very expensive. This, 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 buying this, in Kenya, you can um, see how many, how many are these? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six of them. In Kenya, you are given, you can even be given by somebody this. Because maybe they planted them in their garden. Here, this, very, very, very expensive. very 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 expensive imagine uh, you're buying them in kenya shillings thousands of shillings just this and it's called sukumawiki in our in our culture because sukumawiki means it is pushing the week it's making you push the week so these are very cheap in africa but here for a reason they are expensive very very expensive so let's wash them so i treat them like gold because they are very expensive when you find people cooking this just know it's gold yeah so yeah so i'm just washing i should have washed the earlier but let's wash with you I wash each 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 leaf. I'm going to wash very quickly so that we are together. But the the cabbage is uh, what delays uh, because maybe I can. I don't know if I can be able to move this camera like this and you see what I'm doing. It's a bit hard to see what I'm doing. Yeah, now at least you can see what I'm doing. So I'm washing. I'm just washing them. I'm just washing my cabbage. Yeah, just washing the cabbage. Not the cabbage, sorry, the, um, the kale. There is no formula. You just wash and I wash one by one so that it's clean. Yeah, 
I just wash one by one, one by one. I should have washed already. One by one. And they are very messy. They are messy. So first of all, I'll wash the, the kill. And then I'll wash the... What do you call this other? This one. I don't know what it's called. This one. First of all, I'm washing the kill. And then... I think I bought too many or what? No, it's, it looks like they are a lot, but they are not. Once I cook them, they're going to condense. And you won't even see this amount. But they will be so nice. You want to eat and eat and eat. Yeah, this is good food. Very good food. Very, very good food. And, yeah. Yeah, we normally do this. I wish I have a way of, um, I'm going to learn how to do the video, to make the video. Wow. Huh? Are you, are you seeing my... Okay. Yeah, it's very, very good food. This is very good food and it's healthy, it's nutritious. And this is what the doctors say that we eat. It's healthy. Healthy eating. If I'm not a very healthy eating person, but... Because <laughs> I'm not very healthy. Like yesterday, I ate a burger. So... It's okay, you know, once in a while, but it, I like the taste of this food. I ate five guys. Yesterday I ate five guys because at times, you know, you want the real meat, the real, you know, everything. I don't mean the others are not real, but the taste, the taste that I'm looking for. The taste that I'm looking for is that kind of taste that it's grass-fed, grass-fed, because we are, we, we are used to grass-fed meat. You know, I was also a farmer in Kenya. I had some goats, dairy goats. Uh, yeah, dairy goats, I had, uh, uh, they were very nice. So, and then my dad, also had cows. Yeah, we've grown in that kind of culture. Even if you, we live in uh, in the city, you still you still know that culture. So this is the kale. The kale is ready. I'm gonna put it this side. And then see, it's it's, it's quite a task. Quite a task. Please tell me. This one um, stores a lot of water. You know the kale, when you wash it, uh, this one, the water, you know the water is still being stored in the kale. So, uh, in this one, what is it called? Let me see. Chad, green chad. Let me bring it near for you to see. Ooh, I'm going to make the place. See, it's called green chad. The other one was called what? Let's see what the other one was called. I can't even pronounce this name. The other one was called like this.
Yeah, so let's go on. Yeah. So this is what we do. We are used to and there's even more more food that takes a long, long time. There's food that takes nearly the whole day. Because it's not fast food. It's I think it's called it should be called long food because it takes so so long. But when you eat it, you don't even remember what that it was. It was it took this long because you enjoy. Yeah, I, yeah, it looks like I'm gonna do two videos, but let's let because this one, you know, by the time I finish cutting, so it's, it's gonna be long. But you're with me, so that you see, you see how how to prepare African food. And How to do it. Now this one we, we even we plant out it's a kitchen garden. Every kitchen garden in Africa they have this outside. And even here by the way, here there are people who have land and they have them. Those are the lucky ones. For us we can't because we're in um, <laughs> we don't <laughs> I'm in the second floor. Actually, this is first floor, but underground there are cars. So uh, now, how can you plant here? You can. But one day, one day, one day, one day, one day. Yeah. So yeah. So there are those lucky ones that have this, and they don't go to buy. They have it. So this is what we do. So this one normally takes a lot. The water doesn't come out. It pours on the water. But I like it because, you know, um, it makes the care good for those people who normally have heartburn when they are eating uh, the kale. When you mix with this, you won't get you will get that half Because this neutralizes. This is a neutralizer. And then it's also good to, you know, uh, it makes it even sweeter. Not sweet as in sugar, but it makes it, it makes it uh, taste better. That's the, that's the English. It makes it taste better. So, this is not even a lot. I know your thinking is a lot. It's not a lot. It's um, it's going to condense. Wait and see. Oh, the stick! Look at the stick is bigger than the thing. Not feed one family. No. Because you find that somebody has so many kids, they have very many kids. And so this, unlike here, people get one because of the cost of living and because of the lifestyle and the culture, everything, everything about it. Yeah, so you see, I'm done washing. So what I'll do, I will, um, now comes the real thing. I don't know if I'm going to change my seating so that you see what we do. Yeah, I'll just change the seating. I don't know if you can see. 
I'm not sure. Maybe. You know the other video I had. Oh, my t-shirt you can read San Francisco. Oh, San Francisco, California. Yeah, San Francisco, California. So, uh, when I do this, I'm going to uh, like, because this is where I'm going to, um, I'll show you what I mean. I'm going to, Things are so watery. My goodness, they're very, very watery. But it's okay. It's quite okay. It's quite fine. It's okay. This is how they look. I, I want to show you. And this. I'll put there so that you see and this then the video can show what I'm doing <laughs> yeah so what I'm doing uh, I don't know if I'll stand you know no, I wanted to show you that normally we sit we sit when we are doing this kind of work because this kind of work is involving so I just do this So maybe I'll just stand. It doesn't look like I'll sit. If I sit, you can't see. And I want you to see. So I'm removing the sticks. See these hard sticks? I know this is it's good to eat them, but we want it soft. And I'll show you why. Because when you're eating the ugali, uh, you we eat with the hands. This you eat with the hands. So we eat the ugali, then you take this this uh, kale because it will be cooked and then the meat and then you eat I'm even hungry now oh my goodness it's, and I have a long way I'm now hungry for this for the ugali we call it ugali and sukumariki so if you if you ever so this is what we do yeah we do this so now, I'm cutting them. We don't even use a cutting board. Yes, I have them, but <laughs> we have been brought up doing this. So, and it's fun. <laughs> and it's fun, so, yeah, so now, and there are people who know how to cut them. Me, I don't know. Me, I just cut. There are people who take a chunk and cut like this. This knife is so sharp. I don't know how to cut like that. So, like, they, are, they cut like machines. Like a machine. In fact, some of them, when you're going to buy these in Africa, you you go by where they are cutting for you and you tell them, I want you to cut for me. But they won't charge you cutting. No, there's no fee in the labor. It's just the same as the person who will buy the ones that are not cut. So unless they changed and now they are charging, but they won't charge you. It's the same fee. So there are those women who uh, they uh, they sell this, you know, they they sell these vegetables, uh, and then they are just there to cut for you. So you go there, you wait for, or you 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 tell them you're coming, whatever time. Now they have mobile, so you can call. But earlier you used to just pass by. Or send your child and tell them, uh, go tell them in the afternoon or in the evening we are coming. Or they even have some, nowadays they even have regularly long time. You used to say you want to, you know, you used to book. But nowadays they now know 
so they have ready made because now there's um what do you call it there's a lot of um you want uh to sell more so there's a lot of competition so because of competition because people are coming from work it's just like here you don't have probably enough time uh you've come late you know all those things so they 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 now have them ready they cut them keep them uh in some polythene bags there they don't have ziplocs unless now they do because it's developing very fast but in the days that i was there not too long ago uh they used to put them they cut like this and then they put the things in ziploc not ziploc sorry a polythene bags and then they you know they price them and if you go you you, you will just buy it ready made yeah polythene polythene bags that are that are transparent so you're able to see what you're buying you're able to see that they cut for you and they cut very thin ones very nice like a machine like now if it's then they would have finished cutting all this for me i have to take care because i don't want to cut myself and anyway as long as i can cut and eat that's all that matters that's all that matters yeah as long as I, what time is it okay as long as i can cut eat that's that's what matters so yeah so so this is dinner this is gonna be dinner so right now it's what it's uh 5 10 15 20 20 past 6 6 20 p.m but here they eat at 5 5 p.m that's when their lunch is but us we have never been able to eat at that time because we are so used to eating at night so we eat at night <laughs> yeah we eat at night because we are used we're used to our stomachs are still not used to you know when we're used to something we came when we are already used then it's very hard for you to to change even though there are times when it's at that time but then at, uh, at night you still you feel hungry again. so why not just eat at um, at the time you're used to and then at five i won't have finished cooking because at five i, I leave work at probably three i would have finished three and then i'm home by three by three ten even though and if i if i leave work immediately it depends on whether I leave immediately because it's a four minute drive. Remember, I, 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 I moved because I wanted to have enough time to cook, enough time to, you know, for myself. But there's never enough time. There is never. There's never enough time. Time is always short. Time is always short. You want more time always. So, so this is how you do it. You cut this this way. But if if you've never cut this, you don't cut. Just use the board, the cutting board. I know there are people who are wondering why don't I just use the cutting board but I'm so used to this and then I feel I want to do it this way I don't know for a reason this is we are used and then you have to make them small see this is how I'm cutting them 
Yeah. Because you have to make them small to enjoy the meal with the gima. With the gima. We call it gima. It's ugali. Gima is our mother tongue. But um, ugali, if you say ugali, everybody knows. Ugali is in Swahili. It's a Swahili language. It's a Swahili language. So if you say ugali, most people know what is ugali. Yeah. So. And we, we can get that, uh, that cornmeal in 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 just any store you ha we, we we normally um some people order from amazon they order the, the exact one like i cook the exact one from our country because i ordered from amazon but there are also other other stores that you uh stock there are other stores that stock um another type and I'll show you I'll show you so yeah so yeah and yeah we also have this um the one in the stores that is already cut sometimes i buy that as well because it's also good but I, I mostly if i have time this is what i do but if i don't have time i can also buy that one the one that is already cut the, the baby spinach and the kale you know all that i can also buy the already cut one but they cut with the sticks and they cut uh, you know it's not very nice like this one, like the one that you do for yourself because this one you cut the way you want because those ones are so big they cut them so big yeah so it depends on what you want i mean this reminds me of of home so <laughs> That's why I, I like it. And you find most of our people, they, they do this. If you go in an African home, you find this. You find this kind of thing because this is what we're used to. What's up? I hear some noise. Yes, some noise. I don't know where it's coming from. I don't know where it's coming from. The noise. But it's okay. You know what? It's okay. So this one takes a bit long because they are slide there. They, they slide. You know this one you can take a chunk and cut. But this one uh they slide so you have to take care of your hands so that you don't cut your hands you know we don't want to have a hazmat here in in, in my hands you know a medical in my hands no and then i start having fast aid here no you want to take care of yourself for what you eat everything you know you just want to, to take care. See, the first batch is gone. Then we have this one. This one are not so many. So that's the life. That's the life. See, because I wanted, you know, I just don't want to bring and uh, tell you I cut these ones. You know, it's good to take you through what is the process. What's the process of... Because it's good for you to know the process. Yeah. 
the process so that you know that it's a process. Good things take time. Good things are a process. So it's a process. If you come and eat this, you would tell me that this is the real deal. It's the real deal. Yeah. We have so many people that know this kind of food. The people who are not from our, our culture and they taste these, they know, they tell me, they tell me what I experience in your country. Oh my God, it's good food. Yeah, good food. Because our food is also organic. All the food in our country is organic. Yeah, because people have, uh, people have their shambles. People have their home gardens. People have their, you know, acres of land where they do their, their, their farming. So, and it's not refrigerated food. It's fresh. All of it is fresh. You know, the way we have farmer's market here, they have farmer's market every day. Anytime is farmer's market there. Anytime anytime and you also have your own little farmer's market in your house so that's how uh, it is over there it is over there so these ones they take time but the the, the kale it will be fast the kale is very very fast because the kale is not sliding the kale you can you can actually see this one is slight so i i like doing bits and bits because i don't want to cut myself that's why i'm doing bits and bits of this but Yeah, those who know, know. For me, I just do it my style. Those who know, do it. Do it very, very well. And maybe I can store these ones. I don't know, we'll see. Because also it's good just to cut them. If I won't cook all of them, I put them aside. But this is not a lot. It's not a lot. They normally call beds. You know, when you cook them, they, oh, they are kidogo, few, small. Yeah, so but it's very very good food. Ugali is very very good food. Ugali is good food. Then I throw the ones that look like they are old. This is raw. I want to show you exactly how long it takes to make all this. And then we we'll go to the juicy part where now we are actually cooking it. Yeah. This is this is just preparation. Preparation. Preparation, see? Yeah? It's preparation. Yeah. 
preparation. Going up to the higher places. We're going up to the higher places. Let's go up. We're going up to the higher places. So, my thing is about to finish. Yay! Clap for me! Clap for me! Yay! It's just about. And then now I go to the cave. After the cave, basically, it's done and done and. We'll be able to there are people <sighs> there are people who are just um what do you call it? There are people who are sending messages and I think some of them were calling so I don't know whether it will interfere with the video. I'm not sure. I don't know if it will interfere with the video because the video now looks dark. But I think it's okay. I think it's okay. I think it's okay. It's gonna be fine. I think it will be fine. So here, I'm done with the second batch. This is the last one for the for these ones. Then I'll come to the kill. Yeah. I don't know if this video will be good. Because people were calling and then now it interfered. I'll end this one. Wait. I will end this one and then go to the kill. Let's see, this is spinach. So, this is your spinach. Hello, this is your spinach. I'm done with the spinach and now I'm going to the kill. So, Let's meet in the other video. I'll do another video for the kale and then um, and stay tuned. There will also be the ugali and the cooking of the kale, okay? Let me end it. Bye! See you in the next video.